Well, hello, my lovely wizards and witches. Welcome back to my Hogwarts Legacy gameplay series. Thank you so much for being here. Yes, this is where we left off. Find Scrope's note in the courtyard. I guess we don't have a curfew. What is that? I think there's something pointing me there on the map. Okay. Wait, let's collect things. All right, what is this? Okay, do we incendio? Incendio. Incendio. Okay, guys, tell me how do you what do you do in this section? On this part? What do you do there? And how do you open this? Someone let me know. Okay, what exactly is this? Revenia. Are we supposed to do something when it turns blue? I'm not sure. <gasps> We're at the bridge! Run, the Death Eaters. Mysterious note. Scrope knows about that book you found. Is it missing something? Scrope does not believe it is safe to speak out in the open. Scrope has left another note. Across the bridge, among the circle of rocks. Take care. Tell no one about this. Scrope? Who is Scrope? The troll. Go back. So I guess there is no, um, curfew. Here we go. Um, how do you act, yo? Oh! Okay, I guess that works. Almost there. Head for the pumpkins, just down from the stone circle. Look inside one of them. You may be able to help poor, broken-hearted Scrope. Pumpkins? Oh, I think I know just the pumpkins. place. Pumpkins. How do you open these? Oh, it's just here. Oh, I scared the scarecrow. I'm scaring the scarecrow. Oh my gosh, okay. Nope. Revenia. Here we go. Whew! Okay. The young Slytherin <laughs> might be exceptionally curious by now. Meet Scrope at the water's edge by the broken docks. We- Down to the water's edge. Hmm. This had better not be a we trick. We were literally just there. I should investigate. Is that scroll? Is this a trap? Oh, scroll. <clears throat> Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Mm. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, May she rest in peace. Uh, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. Mm. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black Family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honor her wishes. 
Scrub would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrub learned you were looking for those pages, Scrub thought you might also find the ring. <laughs> what happened to your ear? How did you injure your ear? The blacks have a tradition of decapitating their house elves when their service is no longer required. Oh. One day, dear Apollonia was understandably frustrated with Scrope and got a bit too eager with a cleaver. Oh no! Scrope was able to convince the sweet girl of his value and now views this small injury as a reminder of her good heart. Tell me about the ring. Tell me more about this treasured ring. Oh, it's adorned with the black family crest. The headmaster would be pleased with Scrope for returning it. How do you know about that? How did you know that I'd found a book? And that it's missing pages. Scrope and the other house elves are good at staying out of sight. Scrope hears and sees many things in the castle. Scrope knows how to keep secrets. Oh, okay. God. It seems this may help us both. I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. And place it on the pedestal there. Okay, so good that's... Luck. Scrope will wait Toast. for you. Best of luck finding oh, pages. What? And the ring. I thought it was this. Okay, so we still don't know what's over there. We have some toast. Investigate the grotto. Oh! Oh! What is going on? Oh! Huh? Wait, wait, levitate a bite's tongue. Oops. Ooh. D um. Did I get the dodging already? There we go. I'm gonna have to keep on dodging. Okay, did that count? I don't want to kill it because I want to complete the challenge. Oh, there's another one! Ah! There we go. Oh, there's another one. There we go. Oh, there's so many! Okay, great. I think we're good. Oh. Yes! Yes! Okay, great. Fantastic. Okay, now we can battle. Incendio. Oh! No, I want to incendio you. Oh. Incendio! Um... Oh no. One more? Oh, it's amazing. Amazing. Oh, it's right here. I did not see it. I mean, was it covered? Now this Why is would I need a piece of toast? For real. Why? I suppose that's where it goes.
to feed the squid. Could it be a visitor? Headless hunt. Oh, ah. Ooh. <laughs> ah. The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century, a century ago. Century. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say, I sold the ring a long time ago. Oh, nuts. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. Peeves. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. <gasps> Should we be mean? May our show be nice? May I have them? I'd like to have those pages if you don't mind. They're not here. Oh. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happened next. Here's an idea. Oh, that's how he died? Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest mm. and I'll show you where to find the pages? Um, hold on. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. Mm. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's sure to cause the most chaos. He dropped them after a particularly aggressive romp through the library. Why toast? Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. Really? They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. How did you lose your head? I think I can guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After that, I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Return to Scrope. Is there anything we could take here? Ooh. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. He's just here? What is he doing? <laughs> I need my broomstick! I need my broom. Scrope! Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollina's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well... Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. Aww. That was cool. Yay! Shall we go back to Professor Hecate? Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Professor Hackett. Oh.
Professor? I hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. Yes. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Oh! I missed one. Expelliarmus. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Yay! There we go. Expelliarmus! You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Still at it, I see. I guess that's right. All right, let's do this. Meet Richard at the Forbidden Forest. Where exactly is the Forbidden Forest? Do we have that flu flame? No, this flu flame. What are you up to now? Oh yeah. Oh, guys, we're going into the Forbidden Forest. Mushrooms. Oh. I want magical beasts. Someone tell me how much longer till I get magical beasts. Um, wait. Here I am, as good as my word creepy we meet again richard jackdaw i suppose i shouldn't be surprised to see you it took the cunning of a slytherin to track down these pages well said now where do we go from here follow me i shall lead you as far as i can but i fear i may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise keep your eyes open for a bird bath when you find it say inframuros i think it's latin or greek as you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? We shall. Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks, a stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to this me. This creepy. Wait, I need this flu flame. <laughs> yes. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. This Probably way? best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Adieu. Is that Latin? Or Greek? Hmm. Forbidden forest. Nothing to do now but keep going. Lumos. Uh oh. I'm getting bad vibes. Bad vibes. Bird bath? The waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. What do I get here? Is there anything here? Shall we see? Ooh, what is this? Do I get something cool? Something cool. Clockwork scarf. We will try that on later. Or no. Neckwear. Don't love it, but it makes it better though. Ew. Don't love that. Which which way? This way. Oh, oh, oh. I see people. I don't like that. Oh. Oh, what is 
use it. I want you. Can I have it? Something oddly solemn about this place. Bad vibes. Such regal creatures, stags. Blue flame. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Bird boss? Bird boss. Intramuros. Anything here? Cool. Oh, uh oh. Aren't you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Disarm enemy. Why can't I hit you? Really, it is. When are you going to. Someone thinks they can outlast me! Those loyalists who will fall back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jackdaw has led me. Mm, my goodness. Enter. I wonder how big this place is. Seems huge. Very cool. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. <gasps> I Spider wonder one. if any of my spells will help me through this. Rebellion. Oh no, what's that? What's over there? What is, um, Incendio? Incendio! I mean... Yeah. Oh my gosh. over here oh no maybe I feel like there's a chest might as well I'm not going to touch those really. oh my gosh there's so many oh no Should be something. What? That's it? All those spiders? For another pair of those ugly goggles? Is here. Not a headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself what? to this. 
Oh, all this for nothing. How is my gear slot full? <gasps> oh, are you serious? That's odd. I'd have thought Jack Dor would have been interested in this loot. There's no sign of him. Okay, can we? I don't like these spiders. Let's just get these pages and get out of here. Oh no. Alright, these are. Another puzzle. Well, if Jack Dor could solve this, so can I. Another one? I thought. Oh, right there. Spiders, please. Okay, we're, we are sticking to the pages. Sticking to the pages. No, 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 no. Ah! <laughs> pages. It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Fantastic. No, no, no. Why are these pages so far away? What's that end? No, it's not. You're joking. I'm so confused. Did I already go this way? I'm afraid. Okay, this is a maze. Oh my gosh, I'm lost. Can't go that way, the only way is this way. Literally, that's the only way. So, like, what do I do? What? Oh no. How do I get up there? Oh, thank goodness. But I can't kill it. Untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. I'm so confused! How do I get there? Okay, I guess. No, why did I do that? I, I don't want that. I'm stumped. This has stumped me. Okay, are we getting there? How do we get there? There it is. The bridge. It's almost complete. Oh my goodness. Oh no. More spiders. These can't be what the head of the bridge. Oh 
Oh my god. How many spiders? Spider. Farewell, monster. I can only imagine how these spiders have multiplied since Jackdaw came this way. Ew. Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? I'll need to look around for the symbol. Let me in. Avelio. Oh. I did all three. Closer to Jackdaw's remains and those pages. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping Ooh. these pages safe all these years. Here it is the map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm, is there something beyond this room? Starting to flood. 
We are not drowning. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. Where are we? What is this place? Um... Can it be? Speak to portrait. It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And... Might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss, but first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Uh -oh. mm. That is unfortunate. We have to come back? I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. No. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? Map chamber. I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. No. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Ooh, okay. Dark arts. Cool. Exit chamber. We need to find the book. We need to get the book back. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? For real. How nice to see you, my young friend. Oh my goodness, where are we going? This is like the Slytherin common room. I'm back at Hogwarts. Mm -hmm. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Hmm. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Oh, he has the book. Darn it. Yay! Where are we? <laughs>